Welcome to the Kingdom Wayfinder, and today I'm going to be giving you guys the March 2018 update video for the channel and what is going on and what to expect in the month of March for videos on the Kingdom Wayfinder. So let's begin. So I am deeply sorry for having this four days late because it is actually March 5th. So actually, no, never mind. I'll make that five days late. Um, but basically, um, Let's just jump right into what videos that are coming to the channel this month. So one of the first videos that is coming, which should be around this weekend or this Friday, is actually another speculation video. And what that speculation video is going to be is me giving my opinion and view on why Randall may or may not be in Kingdom Hearts 3. So <clears throat> I'm not going to be explaining why I think he may or may not be in Kingdom Hearts 3, not in this video at least that's going to be in that video, but basically we're going to be looking in deep into the uh, Monsters Inc. trailer. I'm going to be doing that off camera, and I'm going to be gathering the evidence that I have found and kind of showing why Randall may not be in Kingdom Hearts 3. And I'm going, it doesn't just tie in with the storyline of the Monsters Inc. world in Kingdom Hearts 3, but also with the Monsters Inc. movie itself, but I'm not going to be going too in-depth in this, so let's go on to the next one. So the next video I got coming to the channel later this month is the long-awaited, yes, it's long overdue, the Kingdom Hearts 3 D23 2018 Japan uh, trailer analysis. That is coming. Now, obviously there was two trailers for Kingdom Hearts 3. There was this one, and there was also the trailer, um, the Don't Think Twice trailer, which I didn't do a reaction to, I did that off-camera. And... I will be going into an analysis on that because there is some new things that are shown off in that trailer, like a new cutscene, some new gameplay, all that stuff. So, just to let you guys know, that is coming. So, I have, um, so that's already three videos. That is the Why Randall Might Not Be in Kingdom Hearts 3, then we got the trailer analysis for D23, then we got the other trailer analysis that also came out of D23, the Don't Think Twice theme song trailer for Kingdom Hearts 3. So, then after those videos, what we got coming next to the channel is release date speculation for Kingdom Hearts 3, when I honestly think the game is going to be coming out. And then another video guy after that is talking about what might be shown at E3 2018 for Kingdom Hearts 3. And then another video I got coming also this month is the, uh, Kingdom Hearts Orchestra fan event returns video because um, we actually got the news just recently so this wasn't planned um, for March originally but since we got the news gotta go, obviously go right into it and that is obviously that the orchestra event for Kingdom Hearts is going to be returning this year and I'm going to be talking about what we could be seeing there all that stuff and just kind of putting it out there that yes this is coming back for the Kingdom Hearts series. And that is going to be in June of 2018, right before E3 actually begins. So, then, we already got a lot of videos coming this month. And then, you know, if there's other more Kingdom Hearts 3 news coming out this month, like, just out of the blue, I will be reporting on that. And if there is any, um, by, by all means, if there is any leaks that happen, again, for Kingdom Hearts 3, I will go into that. I am not sure if another Kingdom Hearts 3 leak will happen. At this point, because way too much has been leaked, like Monsters Inc. got leaked before its initial reveal. We had some worlds that we didn't know about get leaked, and I'm not going to say what those worlds are, um, you know, for respect for those who don't want to be spoiled. There was no screenshots, we just had, um, you know, somebody who looked into the Square Enix FTPS server, I think it was, and, um, or FTP server, I think it is called, and, um, you know, there were some assets that do point to New Worlds, like there were some assets from Toy Story or assets from Monsters Inc. or assets from Tangled and whatnot. And there were some assets for worlds that we don't even know about yet. And I'm not going to be talking about what they are. It wasn't too many that were leaked and it was not the entire worlds list that got leaked. So that's good. But I'm just, you know, not putting out there what those worlds were that were leaked. As in terms, obviously, for respect to the Kingdom Hearts fan base who don't want to be spoiled. So with that being said, and obviously there was no any plot details spoiled of that. So, regardless, um, if any new Kingdom Hearts 3 leaks do come through, then I 
may or may not report on it. I don't know. I'm still debating on that. Um, it all depends on what the leak is. So, with that being said, guys, um, we have a lot, a lot of videos planned for the month of March, and I do apologize. I'm eating a bagel right now. It's still the morning. Um, so basically, with that being said, you know, so we're basically a, a little final rundown of what's coming this month for the most part is, or what I got scheduled is an another speculation video, which is why Randall may or may not be in Kingdom Hearts 3. And then we know I got two analysis videos coming, which for both the two new Kingdom Hearts 3, D23 Japan 2018 trailers. And then we got, you know, another speculation video of what could be at E3. And then, you know, another speculation video of when the release date is going to, or what the release date is going to be of Kingdom Hearts 3, like when the game's coming out. And then if any other leaks happen for Kingdom Hearts 3 or any other news, I will report on that. Um, and then obviously talking about the, the return of the orchestra events for Kingdom Hearts or for the Kingdom Hearts universe and series. And that's going to basically be a wrap on the videos in March of this year. And basically, guys, hopefully you um, enjoyed this little video um, of me telling you what's to come. And the newest video, of which we're going to be starting off with the speculation videos, or with that one speculation video we're going to start off with, that should be coming in, um, obviously, this week around Friday, hopefully, um, if not Friday, then sooner, hopefully sooner. I don't want to get it out on a Sunday or a Saturday, even though Saturday is a good day. I want to get this out by Friday or maybe even Thursday, who knows? So with that being said, guys, that is it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed this little channel update of what's to come this month. And I will see you all next time. So make sure you subscribe to the Kingdom Wayfinder to see more speculation videos, more analysis, more news, more discussions, everything regarding the Kingdom Hearts universe, and of course, the upcoming and long-awaited Kingdom Hearts 3. So make sure you subscribe. Let me know in the comments in the comment section below what you would like to see on the channel this month. If there is any other videos you want, you want me to talk about, I will definitely, definitely, definitely talk about it if you guys want that. So with that being said, everyone, hopefully you enjoyed this video, and I will see you all in the near future.